Yeah, I think as a province, uh, we're <laughs> we're a little slow behind, and um, it's an unfortunate theme I think that runs throughout Newfoundland, where we're just a little like a step or two behind everywhere else. But I did I do think they're making strides to make it important, uh, adding. I sound silly, but like adding holidays just to take when you need a breather. I think those are vital. I think learning how to rest is unbelievably important and treating it as rest and not as you're doing nothing. I think those terminology it does matter. Honestly, some of the obstacles I see are, are the, I think it's the mindset behind it where people think you just have to shrug it off and keep going. and. Being, uh, being like a male, you hear that a lot, where it's like, just be a man, and I'm a horrible excuse of one. Uh, my, I, um, one of the things they used to say for Dennis's thing was it's okay to not be okay. And I honestly kind of like to flip that to me, like I think it's more normal to not be okay than it is to be okay. And there's nothing wrong with either of it, as long as we can get to the place where Seeking therapy and help is just as normal as getting a gym, going to the gym, or playing sports. I think that's when we'll start to catch up and hopefully exceed some expectations. It's just, it's kind of funny because mental health seems to be like the only place where when you're injured, people just tell you to shrug it off. Where if you took any other, you took it like a physical injury, they tell you the opposite. They tell you to rest, to tell you to look for help. Exactly, yeah, where do you, where do you gotta go next? And for mental health, they just tell you, well, maybe you should, you know, do this or do that yeah, instead of just, something. yeah, everyone's got something or, or the classic, like someone said this to me and I, unfortunately, I don't think I'll ever forget it, but he's like, at least you had a mom. And you know, and that sucked because you're right. I, I, I am lucky that I had one, but it really sucks to lose her too. So it'd be nice to be able to just understand that that portion of mental health is just because you can't see something doesn't mean it's not there.